Hello guys, welcome to Master G Programming Video Tutorials once again. In this video, I will teach you about ignore function and get function. So this is my favorite tutorial because we will be doing something interesting in this. We will be taking the input from the user and we will restrict that input from the user that it will not get transferred to the another input that will be given by the user. We will be setting the range to it that from from here to the uh, till here it will get transferred else it will not get transferred. Uh, as there is a problem in C++ if you are taking an input from a, as a character and you give a long string like if you are taking input as a character and you write a n v i t space as a j r m a like and with Sharma. So what it will do is that it will take a a single whole from whole and with Sharma it will take single a as a very as a value for first character and if you will take the second input from the user it will get automatically get transferred that n the next character for, to the a it will directly get transferred to the next character variable. So this is a bit typical. So I will be doing that and handling that error and we will be calculating the initials of a particular name. Like my name initials are A S. A for stands for Anvit and S stands for Sharma. How you will be doing that I will be telling you. I will be telling you. So first of all we will start with the programming part. Let's take two character values p and q we can say it then c and get this is the function we will be using here not directly seen we will be using c and get then c and ignore which will ignore the characters 10 characters next 10 characters is get ignored and will not get transferred to the next input and if there is a space then also till the space it will get ignored and as soon as the space comes the next character will be taken as the input to the next input from the user for the user and then you will you will get the cn for the q so you are taking two cn one for p and one for q and I will be giving this statement to the user mm, what statement will provide C out enter the name including surname so that's all now we will be printing P that are the initials of our name so your name initials are P and Q and then NL. So that's done. We are done with the programming part. Now we can run this program. So here is the output. Enter your name including surname Anvit Sharma and enter. So our in my initials are A and S. So how this is possible I will be telling you first of all this A will be get transferred to P this A will get transferred as the input to the P then as I am saying we will be ignoring the characters next characters so it will ignore 10 next 10 characters 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 10 character will get ignored and next character will taken as, taken as the input but I have told you that if there is a space also then also we will be closing that ignorance till the space and next character will be taken as the input so as the space comes before the 10 character comes so a space and then s will be taken as the input now there will be an error in 
calculating the initials of a num uh, of a name when there is the name of a person greater than the 12 to 13 characters so there will be problems so i will be telling you how it will how the program will occur let's see we will run this program again and we will take the in user input with the long name like we will take Virappan Kalia will be good and then surname will be Sodhi will work Sodhi so now let's enter this and I don't think so that VS will be initial, are the initials and it will come as the output mm -hmm. let's enter it yes as i said v is the v, I, v is not the initials v s is the initials so what is the problem is that it starts with v it get transferred to p then comes next 10 characters it will be ignoring next 10 character v e e r a so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so till k all the 10 character will be get ignored from e to k and the next character will taken as the input for the q and in anvish sharma the space comes before the ending of the 10 characters so it is taken as the s as the initial so in this we can increase the range of this 10 to something 100 so it will be it will not have been any problem in calculating the initials of a name so that's all from this ignore and get function i hope that you are you understand that and if you are not then share me in comments i will be clearing it out so that's all this is the 50 second tutorial i thought think now i will be ending this series with a gaming tutorial i will be teaching you the game how to make game in C++ that game is not that graphical one it is simply a simple game in this logic will be given so we will be making that game so stay tuned with Master G thank you we will be come back with a new tutorial